Today, we'll discuss about the CSF cell count at the bedside. It's always better for us personally to check the nature of the cells and the cell count. The, the materials which we need are all familiar for us. This is the counting chamber used for the RBC and WBC counting. This is the WBC paper. This is the WBC fluid. When we take the WBC counting, we take the blood up to this 0.5 and this part we are taking the WBC fluid. Here, for CSF counting, it's the reverse. We are taking the WBC fluid only, very small amount 0.5 and the whole area is the CSF only. There is no need for lysing the RBC here. Just stain the cells. So for all practical purposes, it is CSF as such, very minimal dilution by the WPC fluid. So coming to the, the counting chamber, the two parts, either of this can be used for counting. We are keeping this cover slip over this thing. The thickness of the film of the fluid over this thing will be just 0.1 millimeter. We need to have an idea about this marking. This is the marking. There are 3 millimeter and 3 millimeter and the volume 3 into 3 millimeter, 9 millimeter, 0.1 millimeter thickness. So the volume of the CSF over this part will be 0.9 millimeter cube. So, number of the cells over this is the number plus 0.9 millimeter. So, it's almost 1 millimeter. So, when we consider the very minimal dilution, 0.5 you made it to 11. So, you are counting 0.9 millimeter volume, a little dilution. So, the actual number of the cells you count over the whole area can be taken yes the actual count there is no need to bother at all about the counts which we did in the rbc counting the number small number the 80 number of this thing the other ones are the the corner count there is no need to bother at all about uh, any of these things so actual number of cells over this thing is number of cells per cubic millimeter. Then after counting this thing, you can verify the cell's nature in the high power. This is one of the cells focused in the high power. So you can make out the cells. These are neutrophils. There is no nucleus here, just granulomatous cytoplasm. Neutrophils it has become pus cells. Nucleus it disappeared. So what will happen? In the initial part you will be having uh, the nucleated uh, cells, uh, lymphocytes can be made out or the neutrophils can be made out. After some days it becomes pus cells. So these are all the cells which are focused in the high power. So those these things we should be doing the counting and the, the under the microscope you can check high power. Maybe you can see in the oil immersion also under dilution. So the morphology also we can do and if possible the gram cell also can be easily done from the bedside.